not your usual Sunday entertainment. As Israel and Hezbollah exchanged fire, these Lebanese villagers gathered on this mountaintop to watch the show. It was a family affair, complete with music. We were the first ones here to see the shots. Even after quiet had returned, the villagers continued to keep a lookout. But they're taking things in their stride. We were scared, but around here we're used to it, so we weren't that scared. The atmosphere was very calm, we were patient. We're used to it, so we remained determined and calm and just kept on smoking with our loved ones. On the Israeli side, the inhabitants weren't worried either. And yet it was here in this kibbutz that a Hezbollah anti-missile tank landed. You know, the army and the... Something on the, on the air, you know, we feel that there is some tension, but in the kibbutz, we, we live like uh, yesterday and the, uh, the year before. In the neighboring village, some people have had enough. Conflicts like this one impact their daily lives. No one from the government comes here. This place is like an army base. The tanks destroyed the road during the first war and nobody repaired it. In 2006, a war between Israel and Hezbollah left 160 Israeli soldiers dead and killed 1,200 Lebanese civilians. With this new spike in violence, the United Nations is calling for maximum restraint.